I've never actually been on a date though. What? You capping. I'm not capping. Stop to get something to eat. That doesn't count as a date to me. So what's a date? If you call me up and say I'm taking you out to do this or go here to eat there, that's going on a date. Oh, okay. If they ask me like, oh you ate. This is odd. Hey. You wanna go on a date? <laughs> I ain't start coughing till I got over here. I ain't got time. First of all, <laughs> we're not gonna act like I gave you the corona. I'm the healthiest in here. Oh, okay? yeah? Okay. Well, oh. I'm gonna drag me back. A shizzle. Ash and feet. I'm telling you. Look, I, it was. You okay? I was five hours away from self pedicuring, okay? <laughs> I'm tired of waiting for these tiny people to open Okay, I'm about to get a shake up. What the f this? Lemonade. Tea and lemonade? Yeah. Oh. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host. And do that! <laughs> <laughs> I'm here with Puka. Puka, Puka. Mother Uni. Mother Uni. Mm. It's on the screen. Oh, yeah? Y'all make sure y'all go follow her. She got a YouTube channel or whatever. She a slacker, but it's all good. I'm not a slacker. I am a hairdoer. I'm unexperienced. So, you know, I don't know what the <laughs> She can do some hair. And she yeah. don't want to teach me. Oh, yeah, I can do that. I'm teaching her now, y'all. Y'all know I wasn't on YouTube. And her and that phone. Oh, uh, yeah. That's not even my phone. That is your phone. Mm -hmm. Okay. This the hair phone. Okay. Yeah. That's phone below. Okay. I'm going to ask her some would you rather questions because she's a Leo too and her mind is kind of like. Name <laughs> So if my mind is. Then your mind is. No, my mind ain't all that bad. I like to think I'm the more sane one out of those people. Really? No I know way. so. No, you get I'm your panties in a bunch. <laughs> For me? Yes. Sometimes. I ain't gonna say why your panties was in a bunch the other night. My panties was in a bunch? Yeah, you had to come over here, you needed a drink. Oh, God. You petty. are a snitch. Just petty. And I'm petty as hell. And look, I came up after that day. I was mm -hmm. stressed out for nothing. Exactly, that's what I told you. <laughs> and that's what she told you. We do we doing dirty questions because I we might as well be dirty. Okay. Oh, boo, we nasty. Okay. Okay, I hope you like these sauces. Uh, yeah. Chick Fil A. I right. never tasted the barbecue. It's fine. Charges everything. I'm gonna make sure. Fire. They ain't mine. Thank you. All right, you ready? If it was, I'd kill you. <laughs> I kill you dead. About my charges. I mean, two too. of them already then walked off on me like. In the past week, no, none of my charges walk over me, and if they ever do, I'm coming for your ass. I don't be knowing who do it because you know, there's so many people in and out. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes, question me. All right, I'm ready. Would you rather do it with the lights on oh, or off? Oh God. Yeah, it's, we're talking about sex. Okay, well, uh -huh. I would say I don't really have a preference, but 99.9% .9 of the time. The lights just happen to be off. Mm -hmm. You know, it's it's some lighting in there, like it's TV and shit like that. But I, I mean, think, I don't think I was ever in a position where I was getting into it and then I was like, turn that light off. never. I don't think so. Alright. I feel like when you gotta get it, you gotta get it. Mm -hmm. By any means, not sure. really worried about anything else that's going on. <laughs> but that thing, you know? I feel that. I don't really care at this point. I used to. Because I used to be fat. Now I'm like skinny fat. <laughs> <laughs> no, wait. No, that's crazy that you said that though. Because I feel like when I was bigger, I, I'm, well, put it this way. I feel like now that I got smaller, I'm more body conscious. Like, I feel more insecure about my size. I feel more insecure about my size now than I did when I was bigger. Uh huh. I feel like I was that baby. Like I feel like everybody wanted me when I was big. When I lost weight, it's like they crickets. No yeah, like what? My, my phone's so dry. <laughs> my inbox is dry. Nah, you right though. I swear. Like my no lie. <clears throat> now I'm the only one that's into me being skinny at this point. Cause everybody like don't lose too much weight. Ah, uh, mm -hmm. I'm losing it all. 
I be looking in the mirror and I be like, I feel like I pick out every little bulge and like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I guess bigger, I guess because before it was all big. So now, <laughs> now it's like, you, you can like, find every go? spot that's like fat, fat, no. fat. I hate it. But I don't know. Uh, like they asking, it's saying, would you rather, oh, would you rather be choked while receiving pleasure? Or would you rather choke and slap someone while giving it to them. No, no, me. I'll choke you off. <laughs> I feel like I'll try anything twice, but since I've never been choked, I can't say how I would feel game. Choked. You never been choked? I choke somebody. But you never been choked. I don't see why I would be choked. Like what? Because it. For what reason? Why be choked? <laughs> you can get choked while you're getting hit. Can you? Yeah, you just rip. What kind of position is that? What you mean? That's too much work. You, listen, it's not. That's too much work. Especially depending on your size. You small, you damn sure getting choked. Well, I'm eating that thing. I'm not small, so I'm damn sure not getting choked. I see why you haven't got choked. Yet. <laughs> I'm but you should get choked while you at least getting a strap. I like the strap from the back, so I don't think you choke nobody from the back. Yeah, you can. It's okay, not, it's, it's not gonna be the same it's as a size crushing thing. your windpipe. It's like, a size thing. Breaking this. Uh, what do you, oh, like, yeah. if you were smaller, you can get it's all that. I get it. Okay. You can pretty much do anything that little. Fat. Some big gotta work for it. Nah, big fat. They still get choked too. I'm telling you, like that coochie bump. <laughs> you don't like that? Uh, I don't think I've ever done it right because I don't. Because <laughs> you don't go. I, be like, I know damn well it just don't work for me. It's because I have a little vagina. Me too. So um, no. it's like two little vaginas <laughs> bumping together, plus I, plus thighs in the way, and you gotta work too hard for I, it. I'm not into to... working hard for a nut. Like, <laughs> I, I'm not. Like I feel like I just it just needs to come and it needs to come within five to ten minutes. If it don't come within five to ten minutes, you just playing. Are you serious? Yeah, you playing around. So you just want to have sex in five to ten minutes? No, we can have sex longer, but but you gotta come in five to ten minutes. Yeah, I want it to come and then we can do whatever after that. So can you come multiple times? Yeah, I'm good with one though. Me too. I'm great with one. Yeah, it's like mm -hmm. never a need for another. I one. can't come multiple times. That's not it. <laughs> I mean, at the same damn time though, like. I'd rather go one time and then 15 minutes later go again, but it's just all in one setting, it's just it's a bit much. Picky as Leah. I know. I I'm not too picky, I'm just that's I'm just satisfied. Easily satisfied. Fact. Um let's sit here. Is this spicy? Mm -hmm. I like spicy shit. You should have told me. Well, who doesn't like spicy chicken? Good point. Um, first of all, she waited till it got cold. It's dry. Put some sauce on it. <laughs> some sauce. Chick-fil-A always on point, so I know it wasn't them. It was you. Nah. <laughs> You're the culprit. Hell nah. <laughs> and then you waited three hours till you ate something. Yeah. You right. Would you rather have a partner that is passive or aggressive? <sighs> I like that question. Um, aggressive. Pause. Passive people are annoying. They like to let build up and build up and build up and build up and build up, and then a year later you explode. Oh, I used to and be then, passive. And like you just like take notes of every little thing. I don't even remember okay, what I did 24 hours ago, mm -hmm. let alone what I did last month or last six months to a year to you. I'm My no. memory is shot. I'm good. No. Everybody be like, remember that time we and you and I. You like the moment you remember. That's not necessarily true either. Oh, damn. That's terrible. I have random, like, my brain spews out random facts. Like, me and my sister were talking the other day, and she was like, we was watching, um, what's it called? Money Heist. Mm -hmm. And the dude's name is Helsinki on there. She was like, Helsinki, I like that name. 
And I was like, yeah, Helsinki, that's the capital of Finland or something like that. And she was like, how the f you know that? I'm like, I don't know. Oh God. I learned that in like third grade and it just stuck with me for some reason. Some things just stick with us. Yeah, I mean. But you cannot ask me who my teacher was, what school I was even in, third grade. Oh, and that's crazy. And I'll be like, hmm, who knows? Would you rather get back with your ex or be with someone who you like but extremely ugly? Pretty much that's it. <laughs> Would you rather get back with your ex or be with somebody that ugly than that? But if you really like them, that ugly part doesn't matter. That's what it says, right? Be with somebody you really like but they're ugly. No, it says that you feel ashamed to carry them in public is what it says. Oh, I know another aspect. Well. Mm -hmm. Well, you have to like this person, though, is what I'm trying to say, in order to consider being with them. Or are we just picking out any old random ugly tree? Would like? you rather be with your ex or, oh, so or right. any ugly Yeah. Why would I be with an ugly She's person? so damn complex. I just want to hate I just want to understand the question. That's all. Because I've, I've had ugly exes. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, <laughs> would I want to be with my ugly ex that I already been with? Or... Just pick a new random ugly Well, I guess considering that you like ugly people, it don't even matter. I like people, okay? I'm not a shallow individual. Mm -hmm. I'm not materialistic. I'm not, um, what's it called when you like people's physical, mm -hmm. physical attributes? Right. What's um, it called? What's the word for that? A sexist. <clears throat> no, that's not it, but I'll think of it, I'm sure, in about 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. I honestly don't know. I don't know. I feel like I'm more attracted to a person's anything. Spirit. I'm attracted to how you make me feel. Right. I'm attracted to how you treat me. Right. I'm attracted to just your overall like She's attracted to your spirit. I said spirit. Right. That's it. Mm -hmm. So in other words, it don't matter. <laughs> um but I've dated some I'm not against going back to my exes for that way. But for being a that's what I do now. You go back to your exes again? Instead, your instead of somebody new, okay. I'd rather go f my exes. Not that I have recently, but in the past, <laughs> right now, nobody, let's put that out there. <laughs> but in the past, I'd much rather just go call up an ex and, you know, do it that way. I'll go f my ex. I feel like I'm pretty good at doing that without catching feelings back too. Cause I remember, I remember what you did to me. To okay. Why are we not together now? Facts. <laughs> I think yeah. everybody should just be friends in the world. I'm friends with all my exes, but that's so frowned upon for some reason. To be friends with your exes? Yes. Cause it's a bunch of insecure ass people in this world. And I'm not one of them, so I can't relate. You right. know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, but like, oh, I feel like if I hang around my ex, well, if you weaken the flesh and you can't keep your hands off your ex, that's a whole different story. That's nothing to do with me. I don't want none of them. And please believe if I'm talking to you, they're irrelevant. As because I can still be talking to them. Right. <laughs> sure. But I I met a lot of well, no I haven't. I've met several Leos this year. We all the same. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. Even with, with food. <laughs> like you ate all your fries first. That's what I did. I mean, those are or maybe that's a Chick Fil A rule. Mm -hmm. No, I Some think that's every weird rule. Some people don't. Some people eat their fries with their sandwich. Oh. I eat my fries first. I always eat my fries no matter where I'm at. Me too. Because they're first thing to get cold. And who wants to eat a cold fry? You, because you did today. I just did just now <laughs> for video sake purposes. What? <clears throat> Would you rather Ooh, go on a date at a fancy, expensive restaurant or street food at a fair? Street food at a fair for me. Yeah. Street food is better anyway. I've never actually been on a date though. What? You capping. I'm not capping. Okay. Matter of fact, I lie. Is that? No, I'm not lying though. I actually just went on my first date this Valentine's Day. Why haven't you been on a date? But then again, I think I paid. What? I don't even know if that's considered a date. But why haven't you been on a date? Because nobody's ever asked me on a date. Like people always, like if I'm with somebody and we're just driving around or 
we're out and about and we stop to get something to eat, that doesn't count as a date to me. So what's a date? If somebody calls me up and says, hey, I want to take you out to this place at this time, you know, and I'm gonna nobody, pick you up and you yeah, nobody's nobody ever, should. nobody has ever, and you pretty. can have on a red dress. Queenie. No, I mean, like, yeah, we don't even necessarily have to get dressed up, but, I mean, that would... <laughs> that sounds more like a date to me. What you describing sounds like the prom to me. No, I didn't say we have to put on ball gowns. I'm just saying, nobody ever formally called me and said, hey, I want to take you out. No, I'm that saying, way. I don't understand. I'm being funny. Never. I've been asked to go to the movies. That doesn't count as a date to me. Because I go to the movies with my friends. Like, I go to the movies with anybody. Mm-hmm. That doesn't mean you're taking me out on a date. So, would a date be considered, like, um, going to a, a place where they have, like, fallen water, like a like a waterfall? <laughs> like, for real. <laughs> what? Like, like a, a, a place that looks like a mountain-type area, but it, it's like a waterfall. I want to say it's a, even a specific place. I feel like if you, if you had a day set aside for me and you completely just to do things with me, it doesn't even have to be a specific spot. If you call me up and say, I'm taking you out to do this or go here to eat there, that's going on a date. And nobody ever asked me to like do that. Oh, okay. If they ask me, like, oh, you ate and go out to eat to Applebee's, that's not a date to me either. You just ask me, do you, am I hungry? You're hungry. Yeah, who's calling it? Yeah? Yeah, answer. This is odd. Hey, you want to go on a date? <laughs> No, it's it's not fun seeing the waterfall. It's a place of peace. You go to a place of peace where you could woo the. Don't you get what I'm saying? Shut you could go out there. You can see the water. You can have a drink. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And just relax. Does that not sound date-ish? See, that's why you never been on a date because your ass ain't grateful. It sounds like an outing. Okay, <laughs> I'm done. No, definitely not. Sounds like an outing. But you just said if I asked you on a date, if you haven't been asked on a date, but then you get asked on a date, and then it's not considered a date because it's at the waterfall that don't sound like a date. No, no. I could have got some sandwiches together, some chips. Okay, okay. Pick okay, we can do that. Next on my schedule. Next date off is the 17th of May. Alright, we're gonna go on the 17th of May. Fuck the name. I'm gonna have to take it off. I'm gonna block it off right now. Alright, and I'm gonna put water for that. Period. <laughs> Alright, y'all, we're gonna go on a date in a month. <laughs> but anyway. A whole month. It literally a whole month. Like, what's today? Today is like the 16th or something. 17th. It's the 17th today. So my next day off is legit not till next month on the 17th. Period. But we're gonna go see you some other. No That's way. what we gonna do. Hello, girl. Somebody. That's exactly what we gonna do. Period. Poo. All right, y'all. I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. We are definitely on to the next video. You dig? If y'all wanna see more of this woman, let me know. But I'll let y'all know when I finally take on the date in a month. Okay? All right. That was fun. <laughs> Peace out.